And with that, we are off to the races. On the left side, we have SOLIDWORKS 2022. On the right side, we have SOLIDWORKS 2023 PR1. The first hurdle is actually displaying the assembly, the graphic data saved in the assembly. And it looks like SOLIDWORKS 2023 has already done that. I remind you that we are loading this assembly in resolve mode. Look at that, SOLIDWORKS 2022 is trying to catch up. We are recording the screen, so that adds an element of slowdown. Probably we're gonna see a 10, 15% decrease in performance, but still, since both horses are hobbled with the same problem, they, uh, the results are still comparable. SOLIDWORKS 2023 on the right side is in the loading component phase. So 17 components out, out of 20 have already been loaded. 2022 20, caught up. The last three components are the ones that have the biggest number of surface bodies and face level appearances. You can see we are more than one minute in this race. SOLIDWORKS 2023 historically without video recording would open this assembly in about a minute and 47, a minute and 48 seconds. Right now we have 19 components already loaded on the right side. Looks like 2022 is still slowing down, trying to navigate the 17 component. SOLIDWORKS 2023 is working on the last component. If it can open this component, it goes directly to update assembly and then computing graphics. So we are getting closer. We can see the finish line. 2022 is still there. Look at that, we finished updating components and generating graphics. Let's see the final result. And SOLIDWORKS 2023 has opened the assembly. Well, I'm not gonna ask you to wait longer. I'm gonna speed up the video for SOLIDWORKS 2022 by a factor of five. Right now, if you're looking at the seconds, they are flying and still is barely moving. It's barely progressing to the next component. Two more components to load. Come on, SOLIDWORKS 2022 Service Pack 4. Still trying. Remember, we're using the same computer. Both of them are using Windows 11. SOLIDWORKS 2023 is still waiting. Is already went, took a shower, is ready to get his trophy, and SOLIDWORKS 2022 is still running. Is still on the track. Remember, we sped up the time the speed of the video by a factor of five. And now, finally, we are computing the graphics. We seem to take a long time for 2022. We are back in real time, waiting, waiting, and is done. So SOLIDWORKS 2023 is a winner by several laps.